Pluto's no longer a planet, but there might be another one out there. Think you can find it in the search for Planet X. Hey everyone, it's Kylie at Games Unlimited. I want to talk to you about a new deduction game from Renegade. This is the search for Planet X. This is a deduction game that uses an app, which is one of the greatest inventions for deduction games because it makes sure that the game can't go awry because someone said something wrong or misinterpreted how they were supposed to read something. The app knows exactly where everything is and can give you the appropriate clues to help you use your brain to figure out, in this case, where Planet X is. So you're gonna set this one up. This is a game, uh, you can play it solitaire or up to four players. And each of you is gonna have a pad of paper that shows uh, all of the sectors of the night sky. So depending on whether you're playing a standard game or the expert game, there'll be 12 or 18 sectors of the sky. And you have some rules. You know that out there, one of those sectors has the hidden planet X in it. But there's also going to be some asteroids and they have different rules like there are four asteroids but every asteroid has to be next to uh, another asteroid. There are comets which are on very specific spots on your sheet. You'll know that the comets can only be in certain spots. There are gas clouds. There's empty space. But the trick about empty space is that the hidden planet X shows up as empty space. So if you were to like zone in on a sector and say, what's in this sector? And the app tells you it's empty, you know it might actually have Planet X in it. So one of the other great things about this game is that it's not just about trying to find Planet X, like the first person who finds it doesn't win the game. You're gonna get points for correctly putting forth theories about where things are in the sky. So once you think you know where one of the asteroids is, you can put a theory out there. Everyone knows you've put a theory in this sector. You think you know what's in that sector. And a few turns later, it will be revealed. If you're incorrect, we just know, oh, that was incorrect. And you're actually going to kind of lose a turn in a, in a sort of sense to the game. But if you're correct, you're going to get points at the end of the game. And you're going to get additional points if you were the first person to be correct about the object in that sector. So you're really encouraged to early on put those theories out there. But of course, in doing so, you're letting everybody else know information. So they'll be one step closer to finding the planet. It's a very cool setup. You're gonna put your pieces on the board. Everyone's going to type into the app which part of the map they are on and get some unique information. So I might know that this sector doesn't have a gas cloud and that sector doesn't have a comet. You might know that a different sector doesn't have a dwarf planet and things like that. So we all start with some different information and there's different levels. So if you're playing on the beginner level, you might get 12 pieces of information where someone playing on the expert level might only get four or even no pieces of information at the beginning. I've had a blast with this one. I think if you like deduction games, think things like Clue uh, or the more recent Alchemist, it was a very popular one a few years ago, this should be right up your alley. It plays quick, I would say 45 minutes for a game. You can play it solitaire against a bot that the app controls. A lot of fun. That's the search for Planet X. Definitely check it out. Get those critical reasoning skills, put them to the test, and find out a lot of interesting things about our solar system. In fact, each of the player pieces is a different actual telescope and behind your player screen has some information on where that telescope is located and what it does. Search for Planet X, great game. I'm Kylie at Games Unlimited. Come on down, ask us about it, take a look, take it home, and unbox some fun.